<laughs> Good morning, Grimmin. Hi. Did you sleep good last night? You only woke up punching and kicking me a few times. Oh. You don't say. That didn't happen. What face is that? What are you doing? You sure are cute. You sure are cute, baby. You know, don't you? You're full of stories this morning. Can you tell me more about that? What'd you do next? Let's go change your diaper and eat breakfast. So I walked out on the porch this morning and look what I found. My book that was missing. Apparently the guy must have got his jaw unwired and decided he didn't need this anymore and my baby did instead. So I'm pretty happy. It's tummy time! Well that didn't last very long bud. That didn't last very long. <gasps> you sure to look cute in your outfit today. <laughs> Don't get mad, buddy. Do something about it. Roll over. <laughs> Hey guys, so we're just chilling on the couch. We just got done with dinner. I had a migraine, so I laid down with SJ while he was napping. And Chandler Whoa. cleaned up the kitchen. Yeah, you see that, ladies? I don't even know if I can see you. And SJ had himself a little accident today caused by mommy. Well, he's had a bad day all around. He started his day with this. Devastating injury. Scratched himself because he has Wolverine claws. Life changing. So mom thinks, oh yeah, I'll fix that. I'll uh, trim his fingernails. Joe, you want to explain what happened when you trimmed his fingernails? Um, Daddy started bouncing them all around and was moving them and was like, here. This. He shoved his finger into the clippers. Yeah, none of that's and true. And his dad made him. Can you get guys a see that? Cut. Can you guys see this? Let me see. Please don't call DHS on us, but that's super bad. Oh, you can see it now. And it was bleeding so much. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> it looks so much worse than what it was. That is my child's blood. <laughs> it was it's not that bad. Spilled by Jillian the Butcher. It was not That's that what bad. That's what we're going to name today's vlog Jillian the Butcher. Look at that. Look at this. It's not that bad. He almost bled out. Look at him. He's happy because he got Dad to use one of his cool superhero Look, it even bandage, it even got it all party. over his shirt. Yeah, it did get on his shirt. That's how bad so this was. I've got to figure out how to get like, that out. Well, I mean, blood just washes look, out. Look, he's a happy boy. Now, because Dad saved the day. But look at his thumb. And the nail hasn't been trimmed. No, I got the nail. Didn't no, you didn't here, look at it. It's, it's still a claw. And look, it's all cut. We can't touch that until it starts to heal. Ew, there's a dog Hold here. Hold on, that's all blurry. It needs to refocus. 
Either way, it's real bad, everybody. This is all you need to see. This, Jillian Aww, the Butcher. Ted looks bad too. Poor yeah. guy, he's had a rough day. He has had a rough day. He started the day so good, and then his mom took over Jillian the Butcher. She had pants on earlier, but took them off. Why are you looking down, buddy? Look at the camera. Say hello to all your followers. We have 11 followers, buddy. I think two of them are us. No, but we have 12 and two of them are us. Oh, so hey, you're famous, buddy. 10 other people are actually taking time out of the day to look at these huge chubby cheeks and your drool. Yuck. I'm about to order him an amber TV necklace to see if that helps with the drool a little bit. What are you doing? What are you doing? We gotta find something to keep him busy this evening because I have a project for the night. My lovely wife. This is how she takes care of her necklaces when we move. No, it was the movers. It was not me. Blaming it on the movers. That, no. no, they initially did it in Midland, oh, yeah. and then I was too lazy to untangle them in Houston. Yeah. So then to move here, they got even worse. So now this is my project for the evening. I'm gonna be working on this. Well, SJ works on all his projects. He's got a lot of stuff going on. Make SJ untangle him. He doesn't do anything all day. He just sits there. Well, he lost like a pint of blood <laughs> earlier. He might need a so transfusion. He's. We need to get him a cookie and some juice so he can just kind of relax. <laughs> I mean, I guess we could find out what blood type he is now because there's so much on here. I, we already know his blood type probably what is from his the blood hospital. Type? I don't know it, but we should know it. I don't know. I mine. think it's on the mine's A positive. How do you know? Do you does that like a normal thing? Do people just know their blood type? No, I had to get tested while I was pregnant. For the AIDS. Yeah, for the AIDS. Mm. But no, I had to get tested so that we'd see if I need like the Rogram and stuff like that. But well, maybe if other people start watching us, they can actually comment on our video and say, Hey, Shaler, I'm B positive. We all know our blood type. Really, I mean, I'm just curious because I feel like everyone I know is like, Oh, yeah, I'm A positive. I'm B positive. I don't know what I am. And I don't, I had my blood taken before and can, I've gotten a lot of Can you get blood since you came from Korea? I can't because it's. No. Where I was born is considered a malaria zone. I've tried to get blood a couple times, but mm. apparently my blood's not good enough for you people. Ain't nobody wants your blood. Which is weird because I think my blood would actually be superior to yours because probably. I'm Asian. It probably has like genius effects or yeah, something. Yeah, because I'm way smarter than every white person I've ever met. That's racist. So it is racist, but it's true. Like, I'm okay with Asian stereotypes. It's really, I don't get that offended. People are like, oh, you're a bad driver, but you're also a genius and very successful. You're I'll, a good driver, though. I'll, it, that's exactly. So I'll take it. I mean, even if I wasn't smart, everybody would just assume I am. Same thing with SJ. Because we've got these little eyes. And because I wear <laughs> thick glasses, people are like, oh, man. He's probably super smart. Thankfully, I am. We all know. He's already multiplying and dividing. Oh. Oh. Yeah, probably SJ, is. what's four times four? 16. Oh, you're yeah. so good. Look at that. You're so good. So that's like my new thing, too. It's funny that you mentioned that. What's your new thing? I am going to start keeping post-its in my car. Oh, I forgot. And <laughs> I saw it the other day. Like someone did it like as a joke, uh, like a vine. But I think it's hilarious and I'm going to start doing it. But anyway, I'm going to keep post-its in my car and like a marker. And every time I see a vehicle that says 4x4 four four on it, I'm going to write equal 16 on a post-it and put it on their car. Yeah. See, I'm not vandalizing. I'm sure people are really going to appreciate that. Yeah, it's funny. People out there are probably laughing like, oh, 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 oh shit, that's funny. I'm funny. That's funny. That's and not funny. It's not vandalizing anybody's property. You know, it's sharing math with the world. I do math for a living. what you live to do. That's Share I, math with the world. I'm sharing math. SJ is going to think it's funny. I'm just kind of worried about like one day like when we get caught, be like, what are you doing? And I'm just going to run away. <laughs> But I think it's gonna be funny, so SJ, let's go put posters on my car so I can write equals 16 on 4x4 four four stuff. Equals 16. Oh man, he's like squeezing my finger really hard. Oh, yeah, what is he doing? What is this kid doing? He's gonna poke himself in the eye with my finger. Oh my god, look at those cheeks. This is the action shot. Shayler doing work. Oh, yes, some sexual intercourse. 
And by the way, this is totally his blanket and not mine. He loves animal print. Yep. Uh, so does favorite. our friend Phil Peterson. <laughs> Shout out, Phil. <laughs> Domination. That's husband level gangster right there. So I am just being a good wifey right now and sewing up Shaler's pants because apparently he's fat and totally broke them. Now it's really not that big of a deal. The loop just like came off or something. So I just figured out how to get my sewing machine threaded because I literally have to redo it every single time. Like I can never remember. So yeah, that's about it. I'm going to finally get around to sewing these pants that he asked me to sew three weeks ago. So this is what happens whenever you have a baby. You collect a million and five pacifiers. These are just the ones that I found around the house just now. It's ridiculous. So we wash them all. Who knows how many are left? I was telling Taylor the other day that pacifiers are new bobby pins because anytime I need a bobby pin, I can literally look on the floor somewhere and I find one. And I have a really clean house too. But anyway, so this is what you have to look forward to whenever you have a baby, a million and five binkies. Okay. Oh, I just elbowed my son in the head and I got that on tape. Oh, awesome. oh no. Oh, oh. this bottle's leaking everywhere. Okay, no, it was actually <laughs> mom's fault, not mine. No, it okay, was yours. Okay, so, so oh. I just hit him in the head and Joel just poured milk all over his pajamas. That we so, just changed him into after his bath. Good parents. We just did a bath a and we're giving him a bottle. We're going to put him to bed and then we're going to bed. It's been a long night. We're tired, so we're going to call it for tonight. And uh, please don't report us to DHS after what you just saw. Uh, have a good night, everybody. Good night. Bye.